Friday morning in New Zealand, racist white predators slaughtered 49 Muslims on their weekly day of prayer, known as Jummah. The monsters knew Friday was the busiest day for any mosque and purposely waited until that day to strike. Then, while live streaming on Facebook, carried out a heinous act in the name of Caucasian preservation. The president issued a phony tweet written by a staffer this morning and said nothing else on the matter until Friday afternoon. Then he tweeted this, completely pretending he played no role in the deadly mass shooting that targeted Muslims, a group of people currently banned by the United States. People were immediately furious over the lack of mention of the killer's manifesto that praised Trump's racist behavior towards minorities and even listed Trump's token, Candace Owens, as his number one influencer.